This is the decontamination team. They are suiting up to run through a patient decon exercise. Although all military exercises are important, they have a special significance for those on a small base. Because it's such a short turnaround here, having individuals that are familiar with the process, so if real world cases happen, we're not um, trying to train and treat real life patients at the same time. So this way, there's a continuity of care and changeover for individuals who are leaving and coming in. The team takes their dummy through a simulation of what an incapacitated patient would go through. Like an assembly line in a factory, each person works together to effectively and safely clean their subject. But each of these medics come from different parts of the med group. Working with different people, different, different parts of the clinic, it, it's neat to see how they contribute to the team. Uh, each person brings their unique skill set, each person brings their unique experiences and stuff like that, all to help okay, roll, roll. take care of the patients as we do. Um, sometimes there is challenges just in communication, but overall the team works together like a well-oiled machine. When an emergency strikes, it isn't just the decontamination team that will come to your aid. You'll have the whole med group cleaning you up. Airman First Class, Nicholas Crisp, Angelic Air Base, Turkey. Dr. Ben, he just got decontaminated.